Well, if new legislation introduced today passes, the province will eliminate the social responsibility fee. This is effectively a tax on cannabis retailers, where 6% of their total revenues has to go to the province. The province says this was meant to cover the social costs involved in legalizing recreational cannabis. They worried of implications for health, safety and enforcement. Finance Minister Cameron Friesen now says this tax isn't necessary anymore. We're a few years into the legalization of cannabis and now there are more knowns than unknowns. The industry continues to mature and evolve. We have more certainty as to the cost of regulating the industry. And that is why at this point in time, we bring this repeal of the former legislation. So Ian, I understand there are roughly 90 cannabis stores in Winnipeg and Winnipeg alone. What will this mean to their bottom line? Well, a lot of them are struggling, and this will be a big help. Industry advocate Stephen Stair says some retailers will save in the neighborhood of $50,000 to $75,000 annually. Stair says they need all the help they can get. Most of these profit margins are anywhere between 10 to 12% on a cannabis retail store. And if you're cutting it by 6%, now you're looking at, you know, three, five, six percent profit margins, which you can't operate a successful business on. The government will look at bringing the federal excise tax to Manitoba so that that tax will now uh, be, be borne by the consumers. In other news, the government has reintroduced a bill that would allow more liquor to be sold at existing stores, meaning a private wine store could sell anything that a liquor mart does, for example. But there is one big change in this bill versus a similar bill that was introduced earlier this year that died. This bill does not allow the province to expand liquor sales to more retailers like a grocery store if the government chose to launch a pilot project the province says more consultation is needed first. Janet.